Questions on how a deadly high speed chase played out on I-20 in Aiken. An answer we did get from the Aiken County coroner is that the suspect is 43 year old Robert Johnson II. Deputies say Johnson died from a self inflicted gunshot wound after the chase. What we know right now, the high speed chase started around mile marker 25 in Aiken. It ended around mile marker 9. During the chase, deputies say Johnson threw drugs out of the window and deputies had to use a pit maneuver, sending his car crashing into the guardrail. They say Johnson barricaded himself in the car before shooting himself. For the community, it was a chaotic scene. Those on the highway were watching for hours stuck in traffic as this unfolded. Everybody was kind of like scared. Uh, they was coming in talking about it. And I was like, no, I'm waiting on my baby to come there. She's stuck in the traffic. And they was like, their kids were stuck in there a little longer than mine. And she says she's glad her family is OK and really glad everyone is OK. It could have been a much different ending to this story. Still an active investigation and we're working to figure out what spurred the chase and how this chase actually began. Riley.